。美国前白宫顾问波顿以行动力挺亲自来台，周六首场公开演说聚焦中国威胁。I saw a report that、uh, the Chinese government had sent around one of its most sophisticated drones, and the reporter speculated. That the flight of this drone might have had something to do with my being here. I would be honored if that's true. 抵台两天，中共派出无数架次军机扰台，而波顿幽默言论获得全场掌声，同时呼吁中国武力扩张涉及全球，已经不能轻忽。Really provocative to China is that Taiwan exists at all as it does today. Every morning. When Taiwan wakes up, Beijing is offended. 大谈中国威胁，还认为美国还没达到防护台湾目标，主张台美建交是当务之急。Now, on the political military side, I think there's a lot more bilaterally we need to do between the United States and Taiwan. I said in 2000, so 23 years ago, that the United States should extend full diplomatic relations to Taiwan. Uh, strength is not provocative. Weakness is provocative, and as Ronald Reagan used to put it, the best way to preserve peace is through strength. 被视为共和党挑战川普竞选二零二四美国总统的热门人选，波顿主张台美战略深度对话，并在外交承认台湾。面对中国挑衅，唯有民主国家结盟力抗，才能维护区域和平。三立新闻林凯君、温轩 S N 小组台报道。